Alrighty, what is going on guys? We are on the Intracoastal out here in Hollywood. It poured this morning right around high tide when I wanted to fish. Thankfully, we got a little break in the weather here, so we're gonna fish a little bit on the outgoing. I got a simple dropper loop set up with a small size eight bait holder hook. We're gonna put a little piece of shrimp on there. Then a small 3 8 sinker. I lost all my half ounce sinkers. I don't know where they went. But we're just gonna drop this shrimp around this kind of pier thingy and we'll try to see what kind of fish are down there. And the goal, as always, is to catch a whole bunch of different species and hopefully uh, get some new additions for the life list. So let's give it a shot. Alrighty, so there's our little piece of shrimp, super small. I don't have a ton of bait, I just kind of took whatever was left in my freezer from a couple months ago. So now let us drop this straight down here. Well, let's see if there are any fish down there interested. Oh, that's already a bite. There we go. First cast, first drop, we got our first fish of the day. Within a couple seconds, a nice little lane snapper. All right, we got our first fish within 10 seconds of getting this bait down there. There's another one. And it is another lane snapper. This one is a little bit bigger. All right, fish number two is once again another lane snapper. I think this is definitely the most beautiful of the snapper species down here in uh, South Florida. So there might be a little school of these guys under the dock, but let's get this guy back. Alrighty, drop number three. Let's see if we can make it three for three over here. Oh, swing and a miss. Had a bite though. Let's get this back down there. There's another bite. Swing and a miss. Here we go, fish on. Third fish, our second species, this is gonna be a mangrove snapper. All right, fish number three is this little juvenile mangrove snapper. Also a pretty cool looking fish, but I think those lanes definitely a little bit prettier. There we go, fish on. Ooh, this one feels a little bit bigger. Oh yeah. A little bit bigger and it is a checkered puffer. These guys can usually pull a pretty good amount of drag. Alrighty, our first puffer fish of the day. This is a checkered puffer, probably the most common puffer. Actually, one of probably the most common fish in the intracoastal waterway. I catch these guys a ton. This guy did not puff up, but that's all right. So we got four fish and we got three different species. So let's get this guy back. All right, rain is starting to come down a little bit. As long as it doesn't pour, I will be fine. But the action so far is good. Had a couple hits that I missed and they stole the bait on. But overall, oh, there's another little bite. There we go. Overall, the action is great. And we got ourselves another little checkered puffer. There's tons of them around here always. These are such a like slimy and tough little fish to handle. This guy puffed up just a little bit. We'll drop him back down and the action so far is great. A lot of little bites right there. As soon as it drops in, there we go, fish on. Oh, little baby pork fish, one of my favorite fish to catch. Look at this guy. Alrighty, so look at this adorable little guy. This is a pork fish, a species of grunts, just a beautiful aquarium quality fish. I think it's the most beautiful fish in these waters, at least that I've caught. So nice guy, let's get him back on into the water. Here we 
yoke fish on. Ooh, another new species. This is gonna be a little white grunt. All right, another new species for the day. Not a new one for the life list, but this is a little white grunt. I think they look really beautiful. They got these really, really nice bright blue lines on the face. I hope it comes out well on camera. But quick pick, and then we will get this guy back. That was quick as soon as this dropped in. And another new species. Okay. This this one I'm gonna have a little bit of trouble IDing. Alright, so this is for sure a grunt. I'm just unsure if this is a sailor's choice, a Caesar's, or a Tom Tate. Um, don't remember exactly how to tell them apart when they're juveniles. This one's got some bars and a little dot on the tail, so I'll take a pick and then we'll get an ID on this guy later. Oh, there we go. As soon as this dropped down to the bottom, and we got ourselves our second pork fish of the day. All right, can you guys tell me what species of fish looks better than a pork fish? I mean, this thing is absolutely gorgeous. Another, it's a member of the grunt family, just like the last couple that we caught. But I mean, this thing is just beautiful. Here we go, fish on. Something different once again, some sort of a Mohara species. All right, there is not a family of fish that I despise identifying more than Mohara. I believe this is a yellowfin Mohara, but I don't know, all of these look extremely similar. I think there's six species in the Atlantic and I still have no idea how to tell them apart. I made a couple casts over toward the rocks near shore to see if there's some other species over there. We got the mohara from over there. And I got a couple other small bites, like right there. Let's see what this is. Nope, just another checkered puffer. This one's puffing up a little bit. All right, another cool looking puffer. I think our third one of these for the day. I also lost a couple. This one puffed up a little bit. Awesome looking fish. I love the novelty of catching puffers. But then again, catching the same species does get a little annoying. There we go, fish on, another pork fish. Third one of these guys for the day. Can't get over how great these guys look. All right, so we got ourselves another beautiful pork fish, number three, I believe it is. Just absolutely gorgeous fish. There we go, fish on. What is this? Looks like another mangrove snapper. So the diversity of fish species today is uh, nothing short of amazing so far. I don't know how many we got, but every single time you drop your shrimp down, you never know what is gonna come up. That is why I love fishing this way so much. There we go, fish on. What is this? Another lane snapper. All right, another beautiful fish. Definitely looks better than the mangrove snapper, in my opinion, nicer colors on the lane snapper. But we'll get this guy back and we'll keep going. There we 
go, fish on. Oh, another new species for the day, a little pinfish. I absolutely hate handling these guys more than anything. They're called pinfish for a reason. They stab you with their spines all over the place. But another cool looking species of fish. All right, so I know the fish are biting and they're biting well, but there was a little bit of thunder and lightning and the lightning alarm just went off at the park nearby. So I think we're gonna catch one more and we'll call it a day. This is just such a super simple, yet very effective way to fish. You don't need any expensive equipment. Small little hook, small sinker, little pieces of shrimp. You can get a bunch of different fish species. Just pulled in, I don't know, our fourth or fifth checkered puffer. And just doesn't, doesn't get better than this. Alrighty, another nice little checkered puffer. Probably our smallest one of the day. But we'll drop that guy back. As much as I would like to keep fishing, I think we are going to call it a day because I'm not trying to get struck by lightning. Alright, so that is going to do it. Been out here 50 minutes, less than an hour, caught all those fish. As soon as my bait would hit the bottom, I would get a bite. Missed a lot of small hit, but also caught my fair share of them wide variety of species today which is exactly what i was looking for um unfortunately all the ones i caught today i believe i've caught before that tom tape caesar grunt thingy that might be a new species i'll have to double check but still you can't you can't beat this super simple you drop it down you get a fish within seconds just a great way to fish and a great way to spend the day so i hope you guys liked it and i will see you next time